This development is conveniently located next to shopping, dining, and entertainment, including the Porter Ranch Town Center within the master plan community. This property has five bedrooms, five bathrooms, is over 4,900 square feet of living space, and is on a lot that is over 5,200 square feet. This property is listed at $4.4 million and is currently pending. Hello everyone, my name is Sierra Schatz and welcome to our channel. Today we are in Porter Ranch and we are very excited to show you this tour. But first and foremost, we'd love to thank Sean and Rose at the Toll Brothers sales team for allowing us to tour their beautiful listing. And I will say, stay towards the end because we have some interesting lifestyle shots for you guys. So let's go check it out. Let's step inside your grand foyer area and check out that view. You have this beautiful floating staircase. You have very tall ceilings that are over 20 feet and you have recessed lighting and this unique, somewhat modern candle chandelier. You have tile on the walls and area to mount any artwork. And you have these beautiful wood engineer floors all throughout. So let's come this way. You have closet space here and here we are in your in-law suite. This is great because it is on the bottom floor. You have an exit right here to my left and you have storage space here. Maybe you can put your books, linens, TV area, built-in shelves, recessed lighting, and you have a ceiling fan to keep yourself cool. This house is also wired for sound and speakers. So you have speakers all throughout. You also have enough space right here for a couch and check this out. You have a bar space right here. You have quartz countertops, stainless steel beverage fridge and microwave drawer. And this is your ensuite bathroom. You have this beautiful light colored tile on the floor and on the ceilings. Looks a little bit like natural stone. You have more quartz countertops here. And I will say throughout this house, you have these beautiful gold details. You have a large mirror and let's come this way past your bar space, which is great because if you don't want to go out to the actual bar space, you can just store your beverages there and come over here, maybe sit down, relax built-in shelves with these unique sconces and this somewhat kind of looks like a chevron wallpaper design and you have some more closet space right here maybe you can put your tv right there and you have ample amounts of sunlight coming in through this area and i also want to point out on the way out you have this unique stone backsplash design so there is a little bit of texture it looks like maybe some glass and things to emulate that natural stone so we will come through your in-law suite into your powder room. And in this powder room, you have another unique wallpaper design, kind of looks like diamonds. You have a corner vanity with this beautiful natural stone countertop and an undermount sink. You also have the matching gold hardware. And we'll come out of this powder room through your hallway or through your main landing area and check out how open this is. You have all this natural looking tile on each of the walls and look at this amount of glass space right here. I would say this is probably the statement piece of this house. Very open. We will come over here into your main family area and you have these beams on the ceiling with more recessed lighting, windows to your side yard and a large ceiling fan. You also have an area right over here, which is your pass through gas fireplace. You have this beautiful natural stone, your mantle, mount your TV here, hang out, maybe enjoy your wine, as I always say, and you come through your sliding glass doors and we will head back inside. I just wanted to show you this glass space here and let's come back inside to your dining area and check out the storage area here for your bottles of wine. You could fit 42 bottles of wine here and you could look past and see your family area. And you have the same floor to ceiling, beautiful tile area on your gas fireplace so you can enjoy it on both sides. And this area is pretty large so you can maybe fit an even larger table or maybe two tables for guests during the holidays. And as I mentioned earlier, this is a very open floor plan so you can see your family area through your wine space all the way to your kitchen. And you have a dry bar right here you have stacked subway tile, large stacked subway tile here on the backsplash and beautiful dark colored natural stone countertops with the same matching hardware, soft clothes, open cabinets and drawers, all this counter space right here. And you have more stainless steel appliances right here. You have a wolf oven and microwave and we will come inside your prep kitchen. 
And this is a pretty large prep kitchen. You have that same beautiful dark colored natural stone countertop, plenty of storage space. You have an entrance to your garage right here and you have the same large stacked subway tile. You have three burners, additional storage space and stainless steel dishwasher, another fridge and some more pantry space. So let's head out here back into the kitchen and you have the same color palette over here that we saw in your prep area. You have six burner stove with a griddle and two additional ovens, Wolf appliances. And on the opposite side, you have the contrasting colors. So you have the light countertops, the dark cabinetry, and you have the same sink. So let's pass this glass area. And I want to point out how many different exits there are to the backyard. So open, you can enter your backyard from multiple areas. And we will head past your dining space, upstairs to the other bedrooms. So it'll come up your floating staircase and a floating staircase is when you don't have the risers right here so you are able to see through. They also kept that same glass theme throughout so you have that unobstructed view throughout your house, this level and the hilltop straight ahead. I also want to point out that Toll Brothers is fantastic with their staging. When you buy the model homes, they are sold as is, so you are able to purchase the furniture inside. So let's head right here, and I want to point out that this is the main entrance to the primary suite, but we will come this way into one of the other entrances. You have some more storage space here, and here we are in your washroom. You have this somewhat star tile design on the floor. You have quartz countertops with the same light colored cabinetry. And check this out. We saw this earlier. I need to take a photo of this later, but it tells you what you can do to get all the different stains out. So you might want to get a screen capture right there. You have this stacked tile design on the wall with a little bit of texture area for your washing machine, your dryer. And we will come in here into your primary bedroom walk-in closet. And you have all this beautiful light colored maple cabinetry throughout with all this glass see-through shelf space. You have an area here for your makeup with strip lighting and another area right here where you can put any ties or any watches and they are displayed through this glass area right here. A very large mirror and I love the lighting in this space. And you have a full length push to turn on mirror right there. So let's come in here into your primary bathroom. You have double sinks, you have vessel sinks on each with the dark hardware and those beautiful light colored cabinets with this light colored stone top. And I wanna point out this hexagon tile design right here. If you look closely, there's a little bit more detail in it. It's a little more low key. You have this very large freestanding tub. Right here is your other sink. And I wanna come over to this area right here. And I know this might be ridiculous, but I would maybe turn this into like a, a snack, a spa area. You can put your snacks or your wine right here, maybe your stuff for your facials and walk over to your freestanding tub. So here is your large glass shower. You also have the same hexagon tile design on the wall with bench seating and square tile design on the floor. And we'll come over here into your primary bedroom and you have this wood accent wall detail right here. You have the beams above with more sound and you also have this matching classy pendant light right here. So it matches the wood detail right here to your wall and check out that expansive view of the neighborhood and the hilltops. Very beautiful. You can also even see some palm trees and have a view to your backyard. You can mount your TV here, maybe even add a desk in this space right here with some more artwork. And we will come down this hallway space that I showed you earlier. You have an area right here for maybe any linens. And I just want to point out the amount of glass in this area. You can see all the way from here to your dining area, your pool, the neighborhood, and all the way across this level to your other bedrooms. So let's head to my right and come over to your second hangout area. And this is a large space. Maybe this is your family media room. You can sit here and enjoy a movie. You also have an expansive view of the neighborhood and the hilltops or maybe this is your office. There was not a designated room to be the office. So your clients, maybe you're having a more of a casual meeting. Your clients can sit here and watch the presentation, but you also have two seating areas and a darker tile design right here on the walls, large, uh, large space, plenty of cabinet space. And we will come down this hallway to the remainder of the bedrooms. And you have the same light engineered wood on the floors. And let's come inside this bedroom 
And this is staged as a baby room. And check out this accent wall. They are great at adding these details. And I will say they are also great at picking light fixtures. I love all the details. You have two right here and another shade light, sorry, another unique light fixture right here, shade light fixture. These are kind of coming back into style, a little bit of a boho theme. And you have this very accurate globe right here. We were laughing at this earlier. <laughs> Total sarcasm, not accurate at all. <laughs> but we'll come here into your ensuite bathroom. You have a light gray tile design on the floor that matches your gray walls. I wanna point out this uh, style of shower curtain also. Instead of having the shorter design right here, they decide to elongate it. That really opens it up. It kinda makes it a little bit more classy, maybe. I would say let me know in the comments if you agree or disagree. You also have this shimmery quartz countertop right here, corner vanity. And we'll head out of here to your next bedroom. So let's head down this hallway and check out the view of this level from this area right here. More storage space here for any linens, put any jackets. And let's come into this bedroom. And in this bedroom, you have carpet, so a little bit more comfortable on your feet. Let me know in the comments if you are somebody who likes carpet in your bedrooms. You have a doors here that lead out to your Romeo and Juliet balcony. And what that means is it is not a full balcony, but you can open those up and still step a little bit outside and you can enjoy the neighborhood view and that fresh air. You have a custom closet right here, area for any TV artwork. And this is also an ensuite. So in here you have the same light color tile design on the floor that matches some parts of your shower and a unique hexagon tile design on the walls. And the same, oh, similar corner vanity with other quartz countertops. And we'll head across this bedroom, past all of this window space, so view to your front yard and the neighborhood. And if you stop right here and take a look right across, you have a view of both of your chandeliers and a view all the way through that glass space to your neighborhood and those hilltops. So very open. And let's come in here. You also have carpet in this bedroom. You have your walk-in closet and you have this crown molding detail around this room. You also have your own unique wallpaper design and check out this globe chandelier, plenty of light, a little bit more of a warm feeling in this bedroom. You also have your ensuite bathroom. So you have a corner vanity with a dark colored countertop and that interesting white veining and you have an offset stacked tile design on the walls and on the floors. And we will come back out here and finish the rest of the tour in the backyard. So we'll come out of your main dining area through your Western stacked doors and you have all these different segmented areas. So you have glass doors right here, that family area, your main dining and your kitchen right over there. You have some lounge space over to my left with all this lush greenery, a dark colored pool that matches your spa. And check out this water feature. This is your spa right here. So you can just sit here and enjoy those unobstructed views of the neighborhood and the treetops. And we'll come over here to your fire pit space. You have somewhat of a little garden space. And across from me, you have your exterior dining area. And on the floors, you have something that looks kind of like a wood tile, plenty of beautiful large potted plants, and you can mount your TV above your gas fireplace with that wood looking mantle. And this house has cat six wiring for higher data transfer speed. And we will come here, finish our tour in this fire pit area, and just come enjoy your guests and hang out. So that concludes our tour. Again, I'm Sierra Schatz. We appreciate any comments, likes or subscribes, and we're excited to show you what we have next, but stay for our interesting montage we have for you guys. Take care.